built a Raspberry Pi NAS and I stuffed it in this old 2016 Thermaltake uh, V1 case, which is a cool little case, but it was made for mini ITX computers. And what I did was I took a Raspberry Pi Compute Module 4. This is a two gigabyte with Wi-Fi and 32 gigabytes of eMMC uh, memory. And I printed, 3D printed a case. Uh, this case has a top, but I left the top off because you're able to hook the case fan up through this connector back here in the corner. So having a fan blowing cool air across the open uh, board is a good thing here. This is an IO Crest four port SATA drive. And as you can see, I just have one hard drive hooked up to it. And that's it over on the right hand side. It's a Western digital six terabyte drive. And the green light indicates that it's working just fine. So uh, in order to get the 500 watt power supply that was in this case working, you have to put a jumper on uh, the ATX power supply cable to trick it into thinking that there's, uh, you know, that like the start button is on. So I've kind of buried that up underneath everything. I don't want to dig it out and show the jumper, but it's uh, pretty simple to do. I also have an antenna kit that I bought. I didn't want to put this in a metal case. Then the Wi-Fi not work very good. So the old uh, motherboard port uh, access, whatever you call that little panel right there, had a quarter inch hole in it, which was perfect. I didn't even have to drill it up or anything. And then I just connected the antenna on the outside of the case here. So that worked out really nice. So I double-sided taped the 3D printed case down. Not very elegant, but it works. And essentially that's it. This is working fine. I'm gonna add, <coughs> excuse me, I'm gonna add another drive or two. But right now I just have one drive hooked up and it is working perfectly. So that's my project and uh, more on the web page about it.